Hey guys, just making a quick video, nothing too special. Um, I have decided to do plumbing. Uh, I'm going. I, I want to focus on contractors, but you start a lot of off with plumbing, then HVAC because plumbing and heating HVAC is kind of related, and then you go to electrical electricians or roofing or whatever from there on out to remodelers. That's just how you branch out if you want to start a business. Uh, sorry, if you want to grow a business very big and. Um, I don't know, I just, or you start with a website as a service HVAC company. Um, there's like some, I saw some of those examples, those are pretty good. But anyways, uh, I want to go over how I am uh, targeting my services. So this is my website, digitalproductsandservices.com. And uh, I just wrote the general copy. And for in terms of services, I'm offering uh, I'm offering basic website setup and basic content and SEO. Um, so that's all I'm doing. And if I go to services like this person that I just messaged, uh, let's see, let's go to this person's, where's, was it this one? Yeah, this one. So they do for 150 US dollars, they do 10 page website, chatbot on e-commerce functionality, SEO, booking functionality, and free support. So I'll be doing the support for my clients, but I'll be just managing the project because I want to um, see if this freelancer here is great. And I want to just get a small sum, like small, like maybe I'll just make $50, 20 to $30 off this website because this is my first client I'm basically doing for free. Uh, the client only has to pay the cost of the Fiverr um, designer and then pay me $20 on Upwork. Or maybe who knows? I'll do. I'll open a Fiverr gig too. Um, but I don't like Fiverr gigs because I don't want to advertise my services to everyone on Fiverr. I'm only targeting specific um, handyman plumbing. Like I, I want to build. A, I want. I'm more focused on building client relationships than offering a one-off service. I want to continually build that. So I might post my profile on Upwork. We'll see about that. I haven't replied back to this yet. I'm going to reply in a sec. So this is my website that I created using Elementor. Originally I used Divi, but Elementor seems much more popular, has a larger community, and uh, I can get support. I can hire freelancer other I can hire freelance contractors much more easily if I use Elementor. So and it seems more customizable. The, um, you can do more things more you can uh, create more accurate visual representations of what you designed. Um, it's not too important because the tar websites that I'm targeting are super basic like this, just super generic. Um, I mean, generic, there's nothing wrong with being a generic website. You just need a call to action and stuff like that, just basic content uh, and the basics. Um, so it's nothing too special. Um, and I will be contacting. So basically what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to go to like plumbing, plumber near me. And I will be sending emails to, I'll just go down to uh, more businesses, view more businesses here. And I'm going to go to next, next a couple times. And if you go to next, like maybe the fourth or fifth time, you have these like low, like, let's check out this website, only six reviews. The website, this person doesn't need my services because this website seems on like what they actually need. And if I see, let's check out who this company is. Data Delights, their journey to online success. Is it a WAS or a custom agency? They're, they're custom agency. Uh, and always, always check out their, nope, they don't have YouTube. Um, they have a LinkedIn though. And yeah, so that's, um, that's basically what I want to do. Uh, my goal is to make I'm going, I'm going to be hopefully sending them through a referral link to Bluehost, which I think is the most, if you go to WordPress, WordPress dot, no, not WordPress.com, WordPress dot, WordPress dot org, not login, just WordPress dot org. And if you go to uh, get WordPress hosting provider and Host, WordPress hosting, choosing SiteGround, CLI recommended hosts, Bluehost, DreamHost, WordPress. And so I'm using Bluehost. And if I refer the hosting, I think it doesn't really matter. I think most host hosting does um, affiliate marketing. Uh, they, if I refer them for one year, I get like 
20, 30, or 50 bucks, I think. And then same for Divi, no, same for Elementor. If I sell them on one year, I get a percentage of that too. Very like 20 bucks, I don't know. So I'll be making that. So in total, I'll be making like 60 bucks for my uh, my end of the service of organizing everything. And I'll be I'll be speaking with the um cus the freelance contractor here. I'll be speaking with the person on um, organizing all the details and stuff like that, customer expectations of what's possible. Um, uh, just uh, making sure that the client has clear expectations about what we can and cannot do for the limited amount of price. I'll be charging maybe like 200, no, no I'll be charging about 300, I'll, I guess I'll be buying the $150 US service unless they want like the really cheap ones. And uh, I'll be, in hundred. so if they buy this one, it'll be 150 US plus tax plus, um, uh, what was it? Uh, <sighs> Sorry, uh, it was uh, 150 this. And then hosting is about $50 per, for the first year, and then about $150 for the second, uh, and then about $100 to $120 for the second year onwards for re renewal at Bluehost per year. And then uh, Elementor is, I think, 50 USD per month. Uh, so, sorry, 50, 50 USD per year for the plugin. So 50 plus 100 is 150. 150 so about $300 plus my fee which is $50 so about $350 USD for this package to get their website done and organized everything paid for for the first year and, oh and then they also have to pay for domain which is another 50 bucks 20 bucks for the um, domain and 20 bucks for the domain privacy something like that so I need to sell it for about 450 to $500 USD for the website um, and then it includes, it's not just the website, you get SEO, chatting, booking com functionality, 10 pages of website. I'm, I think we're only going to use, we might only, we might start off with this one because we only need two, two to six and I only need a live chat. Let's see, this one has chatbot, which I need. And then, yeah, chatbot and SEO, chatbot and SEO might just include, I might just do this one. So about $400 for the website. So that's about $550, $580 Canadian plus tax, 600, I don't know, something like that. And, uh, yeah, I'm doing my first project to just manage the um, client pro website project. I'll be over, over uh, overlooking it. Um, I know how to do the basics of Elementor. I know basics of graphic design. So if the customer really needs something custom, uh, they'll have to go with the contract freelancer, but I can do some basic editing if they need that as well. So uh, that's basically all I'm offering. And uh, yeah, I'm going to start doing outreach. Oh. Let's see if I let's go to plumbers near me and if I go to let's see nine reviews let's go to this website because I I've seen some really bad ones maybe this one's good too this one looks looks good and this person doesn't need my service either um, I'm gonna go to next and see if there's some more uh, well this one doesn't have a website for real plumbing drainage so let's go to this one so I might. Did they have um, email? Because I, I don't really like doing cold calling, so I'm going to do just warm, like easy warm leads. Because I don't like calling and then behind all hyper and stuff and stuff like that. I like selling them on like the um, the factual services, the concrete service of what we're offering. Uh, let's see how to contact this person. I guess I could text. I guess I could text this person since he lives in my local area. Um, Sirius Vancouver area, it uh, doesn't really matter to me. I'll text him at like 7 p.m. or something or any any time of the day. Um, let's look at his reviews. Professional knowledgeable, got the water here installed so quickly, five stars, great, great, great. Um, but I'm going to be, I was hoping for email somewhere because that's what I would like, but I guess I will, uh, look into that so about six hundred dollars for a six hundred Canadian dollars for a website which is well below the market price I think the cheapest website you normally get is like a thousand bucks but I'm do but I'm doing everything from home with no overhead so uh, hopefully someone buys my services I, I like doing project management that's how I want to make money and uh, build a team I, relationships is what it's important to me. I want to build a freelancer contract relationship like the person on Fiverr and I also want to keep adding on more services for plumbers because if you go to um, HVAC, not HVAC websites, if you go to this website, this is a website as a service deal and if you go to their products and services which is their main thing, 
if you pay, how much is it? Uh, if you go to page pilot, it's like 900 bucks USD per month or 400 USD per month for basic setup and then setup costs. So you can pay that and get a whole holistic package of someone who's doing everything as a uh, service. But what I can do is I can just go down here, look at what type of services they're offering. I can go to their products. I can go to their um, like social media management, uh, charity marketing, cu uh, customer texting, or is it um, directory cleanup, which is making sure your phone numbers and emails, contact information is uh, uniform across all websites, all um, uh, listing websites, because that impacts your SEO. So stuff like that. I'm just learning a little bit about SEO, a little bit about Elementor uh, web design, a little bit about just server hosting or it's just services that I can offer through the website and just kind of creating a general sense of how it can help. The first website I do is going to be, I'm not making that much money. I'm probably going to make like less than $50 off it, but I'm, I need that portfolio to get things uh, going forward. Um, so hopefully this works out. Yeah, so that's my basic plan of doing this. Um, I'm just documenting it online here because I, I guess any exposure is good for me at this point. I, I really have nothing going on for me right now so um, yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, I did some copywriting I really like co copywriting is good but I also don't like copywriting only I like kind of doing everything all at once and creating a whole I like creating packages and I'm trying to create my own agency so that's what I'm doing so hope you guys enjoy this video I will see you guys in the next one signing out